Regardless, now that we found you, our job is simple. Whoa, hey, hands off! Hey, what are you doing? It's just business, buddy. Rick, uh, I've tried everything I can think of to get you to stop being a jerk. Maybe this is the only way. Morty will be staying with us voluntarily. If they find out you're still alive, they will turn you into paste. And if they find out you let me go... Again, paste. Ah, <sighs> well, that's great. Just great. Why do all roads end in paste? This is a terrible idea. It's the best plan we have. This is barely a plan. Quiet, both of you. He's depending on us. What am I supposed to do about it? The idiot wouldn't stay at his post, wouldn't listen to orders. I shouldn't be held responsible. That weird accent. Jeez, I should have known. Nobody on this island talks like that. If he doesn't come back soon, we'll have to try some other options. Uh, what does that mean? I'm sure he'll come back soon. You hear that? You were right. Remember to stick to the plan. Let's go. Mr. Sanchez, you can't bring people down here. If you wanted me to follow your <coughs> rules, you shouldn't have kidnapped my grandson. This is low, even for I.O. Return Morty to his family at once. Midas. Oh, I wish we weren't meeting like this. Be careful not to injure Morty. He's with one of them. Dad, isn't this dead eye power? It appears so. I may have taken it from him while I was on the mothership. He wasn't making use of it anyway. Duh. Do you people ever ask before taking what you want? Uh. Uh. Everyone on this island? You had to bring these two? Eh, they owed me a favor. Rick, why did you come back? Just had to make sure you were, were taken care of, kid. You said my name earlier. Have we met before? No. This is harder than I expected. Hey, how did you get in here? I'll say it again. You aren't as impressive as you think you are. Marigold, the plan. Haunt it, Dad. Wait, no, get out of my way, Rick. See, told you. Whoa, that's a lot easier than driving a car. Um, where are we? A long way from home, but at least we're safe from I.O. And Rick gave you his microwave? Yes, Morty, it was all part of our plan. Hardly a plan, Dad. I don't understand. Why did he come to break me out? Why did any of you come? Um, isn't that what you wanted? No, I, I was trying a new way to get him to stop being so selfish. By cooperating with IO. Yeah, they kidnapped me at first, but then I figured maybe they could help Rick more than I could. I'm not sure I follow. I wanted to be there and I wanted him to be there too. So he could help them stop the aliens or, or whatever. Oh, that's not the way he explained it to us at all. You know, the longer I wear this outfit, the more I like it. I think you look lovely, dear. Can you tell I've been exercising? <laughs> I thought you preferred a more formal look. Well, I can't go surfing in a shirt and tie now, can I? Hey, Midas, Crystal! Ugh, no. Unless you use my real name, I'm not- Fine, Jules. Oh, that was fast. Indeed. Is something the matter, Mr. Sanchez? Well, if you think I owe kidnapped my grandson, it's a <coughs> problem then, yeah. They took Morty? That's what I just said. What do they want with him? He's just a bargaining chip. They want me to work for them and fight the aliens. And to that end, they're holding your grandson hostage. Yeah, I, I went to try to save him, but he, he definitely wants to get out of there, but... I need help. What do you expect us to do? Just walk into their base and ask if we can have them back? 
I know where they're holding him. That's a start. I'm in your debt for creating a new body for me, and I understand the duty a man has to his family. I'll do what I can to help you. If he's going, then I'll help too. But we're going to need a plan. I have an idea, but it'll require something I am not used to doing. And what's that? Asking for a favor. A big one. So he led us over to the base while we discussed the plan. It was his idea to stay behind to work with IO after you were brought to safety. Really? He doesn't really cooperate with people. Trust me, we know. But he also sticks to his decisions once he's made up his mind. And he decided it was the only way to ensure your safety. He asked me to be your caretaker until he completes his work with IO. So he gave me the, uh, microwave thing in hopes that my dad and I could get you out of there while he stays behind. That means he's stuck there! Unless he builds another one, at least. Ultimately, it may be for the best. Yeah, we've been really worried about the increased alien activity, but we're not sure what we can do about it. Well, he's got a bunch of fancy equipment to use over there, but maybe we can still do something. What do you suggest? Have you, you guys been in touch with Kit? Not really. Why? He helped some aliens get new robot host bodies while you, you were gone, Jules. Wait. Is that why I'm missing some parts? But before they left, they, they said they would spy on the mothership for us. Maybe he's heard from them. Hmm. I wouldn't recommend pinning our hopes on some aliens defecting to come to our aid. I was thinking the same thing, but it's worth following up on. Um, I have one more question, actually. Yeah? Rick and I found this cabin pretty close to your workshop. Are we far from there? Oh, uh, I think that place is haunted. So, you, you must be wondering, why am I still here? Uh, you weren't standing close enough to the girl with the microwave? Very <coughs> funny. No, I'm here to join you. Yeah, right. In what world are you going to come here and help us with no leverage? You already played your cards, Doctor, and you saw me play mine. We could continue doing terrible things to each other, or we could work together. And you think that's enough for us to trust you? We don't have any protection without Morty. Look, I can tell you're used to having the upper hand. You're like the gods of this world or whatever, but I've played god over so many planets and so many dimensions. This isn't inspiring my confidence in you, Mr. Sanchez. Just, just listen. If I wanted to give you a hard time, it would be easy. But instead, I'm here helping you, because as long as I'm stuck in this dimension, you and those aliens are the biggest threat to my family. So you know, two birds with one stone. That does make sense. So you're saying you're here voluntarily to help us take on the alien invasion, just to make sure we don't take your hammer again? You're awful slow for someone who's supposed to be a doctor. This just isn't the move we were anticipating you would make, but it's quite welcome, I assure you. And good timing, actually. Yep, that's me. Best <coughs> timing ever. Wait, why is it good timing? We've just acquired a new asset. One that I'm confident will prove very valuable. Lucky me. Where is it? We'll let you check it out later. Maybe you could take a tour of our telescope or other monitoring system first. Please. I've been using basic equipment like this since before you were born. What's wrong with this asset? It's a little sensitive right now. Ugh. Where... where am I? I have never seen this place before. <gasps> oh no! My disguise! Wait... This place appears to have more advanced technology and materials than any other place I've seen on this island. If I have been discovered, I must be closer to the Nexus than ever before. I am being held inside the IO base. <laughs> 